Hello my YouTube subscribers, I'm here with another e-liquid review. I got my cotton today, so I'm going to be reviewing Cosmic Fog, the Shocker. This is from Mad Vapes. I even opened this up. Um, it's got kind of a really cool bottle. It's got a really nice, um, man, what would I say? I don't know, man, it kind of looks like a neon poster, or a black light poster. Says warning contains nicotine ingredients, USP propylene glycol, USP vegetable glycerin, natural and artificial flavoring. Not a not for sale to minors. Like us on Facebook. On the other side here, it's got cosmicfogvapors.com. Check out our other flavors: kryptonite, nuts, cola, no cola gummy, church milk and honey, made in America. It's got a batch number: unforgettable forget about it I get the joke so this is really low nicotine because I've been vaping on these big cloudy coils now and I've had to drop my nicotine uh, let's take a look at my uh, build here I'm going to be using the uh, uh, tugboat I decided to go with another uh, parallel coil build this time I pre torched my wick because I've been having really really terrible time building a wick and then uh, getting it hot to um, to tighten it up and then like especially with the parallel coil like part of the the coil will just like shrink really tight and uh, the other part won't so I pre-torched it and that helped uh, get the springiness out of it and uh, it actually coiled a lot better this time so we got the bottle here. This has got mostly a transparent uh, view, you know, or coloration, opacity. It's mostly transparent. Smells really good right now. It's supposed to be a, a lemonade. It smells really good like lemonade. Um, I'm going to go ahead. Oh, son of a bitch. I'm going to go ahead and put this right on my mod and spill it. Did I get my battery wet? I hope not. Better check to see if I got my battery wet. I don't know about this uh, stingray right now. I don't know like how well it's going to seal. I'm dropping everything. Looks good. Looks good. I just need to wipe off where I spilled. Total nub move. All dry. Alright. I'm going to fill this up. Then I'm going to put it on. So, you know, I, f I stuff this tugboat with wick, and uh, it seems to hold the liquid better. There were a couple times where I didn't stuff it with wick, and um, I, f I felt like I was just constantly dripping in it again, and it got really bothersome. So, this time I stuffed it with wick. This is some organic cotton wick I got off of Amazon. It really, I get a really good deal. Three big bags of organic cotton wick. I think I won't be asking for wick for a while here. Because I got plenty of it. So I'm going to get this uh, a little bit more saturated. And then uh, I'm going to see how it fires. It's got a brand new, freshly charged 18650. I like the parallel coil because it really really clouds up. I think it's a, a little bit better than the twisted coil. The twisted coil is really easy to wrap though. So it's got a little safety feature on the bottle which is kind of cool. Alright, let's see how this thing vapes. I imagine she's going to pop. Looking good. Looking real good. It's got a nice uh, aroma of like, um, I don't know, I want to say like a powdery uh, lemonade, like something you would get some from a, a powder. Can't quite, can't quite put my finger on it, but it's it's definitely uh, reminiscent of uh, a lemonade. It's got a very uh, citrusy scent to it. Let's see how she vapes.
Vape's good. Um, boy, that's that's pretty tasty right now. Really good vapor production. I don't know what the PG-VG ratio is on this. It doesn't say. Um, let's take a look at it through the blunt tip syringe. Should have did that beforehand. Um, Flavor-wise, it's it's okay. I'm going to say it's about 50-50. looks like I got a little bit of something else in there, so I'm not going to put that back in. I would say it's about 50-50. Not 100% sure. Um, I'm going to have to look at the web page and, and see. But right now, I'm just going to quickly determine that it's around 50 50. Vaping like a champ in this uh, tugboat with a stingray and this uh, parallel coil. It is seven wraps of uh, 28 gauge canthal wire that is the the number of wraps and it is wrapped with a 7 64th screw so it's a little wider a little more barely than uh, uh, what I usually wrap just chalking vapor holy moly awesome uh, Cosmic Fog, that's a pretty good name for this right now. Amazing amounts of vapor. Um, I don't know about the flavor, man. I'm thinking the flavor is a little, a little mild. It has a nice, um, I guess I want to say it has a mild, uh, lemony lemonade taste to it but um it's not what i was expecting or hoping for anyway you know it's not like a powerful blast of of lemonade right in my mouth it is it's honestly a little mild when it comes to flavor It's not terrible. Holy cow. It's not terrible by any means. Um, I think this could be an all-day vape. Um, you know, it's it's enjoyable. Uh, it's it's pretty flavorful. It tastes, to me, it kind of tastes like a, um, a milder lemonade. And uh, that's what I was, that's what they're going for is lemonade. It says the shocker. You know what? I'm going to open this up on... Um, the shocker. Let's search for it. No, 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 no. <laughs> Not the hand gesture. No idea. <laughs> Cosmic fog. Here we go. The shocker. Shocking lemonade and citrus notes capped off by a medley of strawberry, strawberries, apples, and mangoes. You know, I'm not really getting much of that. Your new all-day vape. I could say it's a pretty good all-day vape. Holy moly, that's freaking cloudy. Um, it doesn't tell me what the PG-VG ratio is. Like I said, uh, I'm betting it's 50-50, uh, but uh, I'm not 100% sure. I'm going to vape with the tugboat on the outside. I guess I don't know about the flavor. I get the lemonade flavor. 
I'm not really getting the medley of strawberries, the apples, and mangoes. Um, I guess maybe they're more undertones. It is kind of a summertime vape. I'll agree with him on that. Um, it does kind of taste like something you would, um, you know, drink on when you're outside in the summer, uh, which makes it enjoyable in that aspect. Um, I did get six milligrams here of uh, nicotine, so maybe having less nicotine would uh, uh, reduce the flavor. Um, I don't really know. Amazing vape, though. Amazing. Um, at least with this build, this setup is doing really awesome. Um, I got to say, this is... Um, clouding up really good I, I really enjoy that I don't know I didn't really give it much ste steep time either I don't think I want to give it much steep time I, I just want to vape it, it it's uh it's pretty good right right now the way it is so you know I don't think I would uh say go ahead and buy it um it's amazing it's it's brand new fresh the best um, but it's definitely something I would say, you know, I'd pass it to you and say, go ahead and try it and see if you like it. Um, they only have 15 milliliter bottles uh, available, um, and it is $12 for a bottle, eleven ninety nine around up 12 So, you know, if you think this is something for you, uh, go ahead and take a stab at it. Um, if you're not really into, like, fruity flavors, um, maybe... I guess maybe stay away. The lemonade flavor is kind of good. I'm not really getting the fruit medley notes, though. Maybe they're, uh, I don't know. I'm not really getting them. So, Cosmic Fogs for Mad Vapes. It's good. Not great. Freaking cloudy. Holy crap. Let's get one more plume on this motherfucker. awesome really good and it's also a really good build so if you like this video go ahead and click like uh, feel free to share this video if you think it'll help someone else feel free to comment on my video i do try to respond to all of my commenters and if you haven't clicked subscribe go ahead and click subscribe now i'm going to be doing more videos in the future until next video bye